Hi, I wanted to give you some examples of how I can actually use this fantastic brush and why do I use it. Um, for one thing, again, I love the weight of the brush and how it feels in the hand. I love how it pushes the paint around the palette or on a large scale canvas. So I'm going to start off with just a very simple color blend and show you how well this brush works. This really holds a tremendous amount of pigment. I can load the brush up and it'll go for days and days and days, it seems like, before I have to reload the brush. It can really push that paint around. Um, for example, if I was going to do a color blend where I want to blend in some white with this cadmium and then bring in some of this yellow, uh, let me s show you what happens. I'm going to start off with, and you can see when the brush is super saturated like this, it creates a wonderful opaque surface. Well, let's assume that I want to do a color blend. Now I'm going to be bringing in some other color, in this case yellow, mixed in with a little bit of white, and of course trying to make sure that I have the same consistency of water to paint that I used previously. And then I'm just going to simply put down a layer. Now watch what happens with this. I'm going to use a figure eight movement, and then with that figure eight, it's picking up some of the previous pigment and it's naturally integrating. I'm going to over exaggerate this movement. It's almost like ice skating, but I'm bringing in that top layer into the bottom layer and it creates a really nice transition here. In addition to that, again, by working this brush back and forth, I create a wonderful edge and you can see that that edge will hold a really tight line. So if I needed to create a fairly small line, even using a large brush, it will do that. It will maintain that edge. So try it. I think you'll really enjoy this. Thanks a lot. I'm Bob Rankin and this is my Big Bad Brush.